Cup Assembly include capacity development for complex operations, review of Nigerian Army infrastructure, mid-margin trends, improve strategic communication, bridging gaps in force levels, as well as enhancing support for other services, government ministries, departments, and agencies, and international partners to defeat the numerous threats confronting the nation. To the participants, let me remind you that you are in the power on which the training and operations of the Nigerian Army rests. I urge you to take the opportunity offered by this seminar to enhance your command and leadership ability. This time around, we are facing commanders in the Southern Formation with particular emphasis of international best practices, aspects of rules and of engagement, international humanitarian law, international human rights law. So to emphasize commanders on how best this can be applied in all their operations. Roles to play. So the military is organizing seminar, training, uh, conferences to make sure they work on their own area. But the politicians are not here with them. They're not here with us. So we also need to tell the politicians, this is your own beat. The military is training themselves on their own beat. The politicians are not here. And they don't train themselves. They don't hold seminars like this. All right? The whole issue about state police, for example, we're overlaboring our military. The military is doing a lot of police job. We're overusing them, we're overstretching them. And so let the country recognize, train, and fund the police as the lead agency for internal security. Once this is done, then we can relieve the military of the non-military jobs they are doing. Then when the country creates jobs for the millions of our youth, the federal government has a planning commission. Let them meet with the tertiary heads, meet with the private sector chiefs on how to create at least two million jobs every year so that our youth can be engaged. All right? By the time we get engage our youth, all this criminality, you see, the youths also interact with youths all over the world. They know what they are doing all over the world. And they have to marry, they have to build their own houses, they have to ride cars, so they have to work. So we need the government to create millions of jobs so that we can all live in safety and peace.